Good morning and welcome to Daily Morning Prayer. This is for Monday, December 27th, and we are gathered together in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our song for this morning, we're continuing with some Christmas songs, because uh, remember that the Christmas season is a 12-day long season. The 12 days of Christmas start on Christmas Day, uh, and so we will continue doing that. Uh, our song for this morning is Hark the Herald Angels Sing, and we that is hymn number 270 in Evangelical Lutheran Worship, the Cranberry Hymnal. And we'll sing the first verse together. Hark the herald angels sing, glory to the newborn king. Peace on earth and mercy mild, God and sinner reconciled. Joyful all you nations rise, join the triumph of the skies. With angelic hosts proclaim, Christ is born in Bethlehem. Hark the herald angels sing, glory to the newborn king. Our quote for this morning comes from uh, from John Pattinson, Patton, Pattison, excuse me. If lack is the root of injustice, then gratitude is at the root of justice. Our psalm for this morning is Psalm 148. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord from the heavens. Let that go by. Praise the Lord in the heights. Praise the Lord, all God's angels. Praise the Lord, all God's hosts. Praise the Lord, sun and moon. Praise the Lord, all you shining stars. Praise the Lord, you highest heavens and you waters above the heavens. Let them praise the name of the Lord. For God commanded and they were created. God established them forever and ever. God fixed their bounds which cannot be passed. Praise the Lord from the earth, you sea monsters and all the deeps, fire and hail, snow and frost, stormy wind fulfilling God's command, mountains and all hills, fruit trees and all cedars, wild animals and all cattle, creeping things and flying birds, kings of the earth and all peoples, princes and all rulers of the earth, young men and women alike, old and young together. Let them praise the name of the Lord, for God's name alone is exalted. God's glory is above earth and heaven. God has raised up a horn for the people. Praise for all of God's faithful, for the people of Israel are close to the Lord. Praise the Lord. Our Old Testament reading comes from Proverbs chapter 8, verses 32 through 36. And now, my children, listen to me. Happy are those who keep my ways. Hear instruction and be wise and do not neglect it. Happy is the one who listens to me, watching daily at my gates, waiting beside my doors. For whoever finds me, that is wisdom, finds life and obtains favor from the Lord. But those who miss me injure themselves. All who hate me love death. Our New Testament reading comes from the Gospel of John, the 21st chapter, verses 19 through 24. Jesus said this to indicate the kind of death by which he would glorify God. After this, he said to him, that is Peter, follow me. Peter turned and saw the disciple whom Jesus loved following them. He was the one who had reclined next to Jesus at the supper and had said, Lord, who is it that's going to betray you? When Peter saw him, he said to Jesus, Lord, what about him? Jesus said to him, If it is my will that he remains until I come, what is that to you? Follow me. So the rumor spread in the community that this disciple would not die. Yet Jesus did not say to him that he would not die, but if it is my will that he remain until I come, what is that to you? This is the disciple who is testifying to these things and has written them. And we know that his testimony is true. Gathered into one by the Holy Spirit, let us pray as Jesus taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. 
Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord's face shine on you with grace and mercy. The Lord look upon you with favor and give you peace. Amen.